Keishan Davis says it's unimportant to avenge his three losses to 2020 Olympic gold medalist Andy Cruz from their days as amateurs because he's now a pro. Unfazed by amateur losses, the lightweight contender Keishan 10 0. Seven Cos is complaining about Tefimo Lopez, letting him know that he wants to avenge his losses to Cuban Andy Cruz 3 0. One cause before he considers giving him a crack at his WBO light welterweight title. Keishan feels that he doesn't have to fight Cruz because things are different now with the two in the pros, and fans don't even know about his losses. That's true. Casual boxing fans aren't aware that Cruz schooled Keishan three times, but they don't know who he is anyway. The problem is, the hardcore boxing fans do know about Keyshawn's three defeats against Cruz, and they are the ones who watch his fights. Looks weak that Keyshawn prefers to fight weaker opposition rather than face Cruz again. It's troubling that Keyshawn thinks Tefemo should give him a fight because he's asking for it, and he doesn't feel he needs to earn it. Where does Keyshawn get an attitude like that from? Where? Did the sense of entitlement come from? Has? Keisham been spoiled so he doesn't think he needs to earn things. It's a bizarre attitude. Keisham trash. Tefemo today on social media because he's defending his WBO 140LB title against Steve Claggett 3872. 26 costs on June 29th at the James K. Knight Center in Miami Beach. Ford. He feels. That's a poor choice for Tefimo because fans don't know who he is. Keishun is fighting. Little know Miguel Maduro 31 2. 28 costs next on July 6th at the Prudential Center in Newark, New Jersey. For fans that don't know, Maduro lost to Steve Claggett last year in 2023 in a lopsided 10 round unanimous decision. If Keishun feels Claggett is such a poor choice for Tefimo, then why is he fighting the guy that he beat by a one-sided decision last year?